The World Cup has uh, this unique faculty of being able to change the perception people have about the place, about the country. People will see Russia as a different country, as a country that is welcoming the world, as a country that is festive, that wants to celebrate, that wants to be open. What is nice in a World Cup is that there are always surprises, right? Of course, at the end, you will have the usual teams, maybe, but maybe there is a surprise. You never know, this happens only in football, and in the World Cup we can have some surprises on players that we have never seen. So I'm looking particularly forward to uh, watching those teams who, quali who have qualified for the first time. We have achieved quite a lot in the last couple of years in terms of football development, in terms of investments, in terms of reforms. In terms of deciding, speaking about the World Cup, that uh, the new World Cup, as of 26, will feature 48 teams, so more inclusion, more participation, more celebration, more festive atmosphere around the world. This is something that I think we can be proud of, but I think the most important element is that we have really put football back in the center of what we do, and uh, we'll witness it again as of one week from now uh, with the kickoff of the World Cup.